Hi, I'm Angie Monko. I'm a life coach for intuitive women leaders. Today, I want to talk about the people pleaser, or that we call it just the pleaser saboteur, according to positive intelligence. And according to them, the pleaser indirectly tries to gain acceptance and affection by helping, pleasing, rescuing, or flattering others. They lose sight of their own needs and become resentful as a result. So if you grew up as empathic, intuitive, um, you learned how to please others to gain their approval. You probably were sensitive and had a big heart, but you didn't have a filter to discern who you could trust or who you couldn't trust. So it felt safer just to please other people and not share your true thoughts and feelings. Do you ever feel misunderstood? Just like, I don't know where I fit in. I don't know where I belong really. Um, and I know that I'm that way. Like I, I know that I'm weird and, and that's okay. I used to not like that, but now I wear it with pride. But still childhood wounds run deep with needing others to like us. You know, we wanna fit into the tribe. It's, it's hardwired into us to fit to our tribe. So, um, and when we feel like we don't, our safety is threatened. And you've probably noticed this a lot in the last three years, right? So pleasing other people and genuinely wanting to be of service to them is a wonderful human trait, actually. Okay, so it starts out that way, but when taken too far, we abandon ourselves and our relationships become based on something fake because we've worn a mask to hide our true selves when we attracted that relationship to start with. So I invite you to reach out to me, go to the tab called let's chat at harmonyharbor.com and let's have a conversation how to start to rein in that pleaser and really be for you to feel free to be who you are.